Well, hello there, everyone. Did you just buy yourself a DJI Avada and you're trying to figure out how to get it set up so you can take your first flight? Well, let me walk you through exactly what you need to do to get it up and running. Let's get right into it. So first things first, you're going to need all your equipment. You're going to need your Avada. You're going to need your goggles. I had the V2, the old school goggles for the DJI FPV, and I had the motion controller. You're also going to need your smartphone. I have an iPhone 11. You're going to need the cable for the battery, the battery for the goggles, and you're going to need your wire for the smartphone to connect to the goggles. The package also comes with a little attachment that you can also attach if you don't have the right wire. So go look for that if you don't have the right wire. The iPhone wire connects right into the side and right into your iPhone, so it's perfectly made for it. You're going to want to make sure that all your batteries are fully charged if you have to go through the firmware update. You're going to want to make sure the Avada is charged, the goggles are charged, and the motion control is fully charged. Go ahead and plug in the batteries to the goggles. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and jump into the DJI Fly app. That's going to pull up like that. It's going to show the connection guide. You're going to go ahead and hit on that. You're going to want to pick your drone that you're trying to fly. Go ahead and pick the DJI Avada. Then you go ahead and pick which goggles you have. I have old school goggles. Now it's gonna prompt you to connect the goggles and the battery, turn everything on and make sure that everything is working. So I'm gonna go ahead and connect the USB port after everything is on. So let's go ahead and get everything on first. Turn the motion controller on. Turn the goggle battery on. Make sure the battery is in and your gimbal cover is off. And go ahead and throw on the Avada. Oh yeah. Now everything is on. Now I'm going to go ahead and plug my phone wire connected already to my phone right here. I'm going to go ahead and plug the other side into the goggles right here in this port right here. Okay, now it's plugged in. So on here right here, this will pop up. Firmware version inconsistent. Update firmware before use. Go ahead and hit continue. It'll show, show this screen right here, firmware updating, approximately one minute. Just let it chill for a minute. It'll show everything's connected in the background. There might be some movement, movement in the background, but just let this do what it's doing. Okay, so right now it says it's searching for the aircraft. I'm gonna wait for that to finish up. It's looking for the Avada. Now it's gonna come up with this. So unable to connect the aircraft, go ahead and hit that. Now what you're going to want to do is hold down the button, the power button, on the DJI Avada itself for 4 seconds until it makes a beep and then go ahead and hit paired. Okay, now it's paired. Now you got to pick your controller. So I'm going to go ahead and motion controller. What you're going to want to do with the motion controller is you're going to want to hold down the button on the motion controller for 4 seconds until it makes a beep. Now it's beeping constantly, go ahead and hit the button, the power button on the DJI Avada for 4 seconds, hold that down until it beeps, and then go ahead and hit, it should pair, yeah see it pair, okay so if you have any problems just go ahead and hit problem connecting. Now you do the same thing with the goggles, the goggles are already connected for me, but as you can see here right here on the screen they're already connected, but the same thing with the goggles. Now you're going to want to do the same thing with the goggles if you have a problem connecting and it's not connecting. There's a little button down here that you've got to go ahead and hit with a little tiny pin. So go ahead and hold that down for three seconds and then hold the power button on the DJI Avada for four seconds until it starts to beep and they should connect on your phone. As you can see here on my phone, I'm already connected and everything. Now when you first start it up, it may ask you to update more firmware on the home screen. On here, right here, on the top left corner. You might just get this screen. If you just get this screen and you're not able to see the go fly, that means you're waiting for an update. Go ahead and click that update. It might take a while. That's why I said make sure that your batteries are charged. So make sure all your batteries are charged. Walk through the steps I just showed you. And if you're only getting this screen and there's a bar up here that says something like update, go ahead and click update and wait for the update. Then go ahead and restart everything. As soon as it's over, as soon as the update is over and it's not showing any more whatever is not showing any more loading, go ahead and restart everything because everything will be started as you're updating and uh, it'll restart itself three, four, or five times. But you want to walk through all the steps I just showed you. If you have any problems, just go ahead and keep updating until it finishes all up and then you should be able to hit go fly 
and see right into your goggles and you can't see here but in my goggles right here I can see perfectly so that is how you get everything started and updated and firmware and everything you got to set up everything with the phone and everything but now that we're connected I go ahead and unplug the phone see I'm gonna go ahead and unplug it because I don't need the phone to be in there anymore and it should stay connected yep everything is connected in there the goggles look good I'm gonna go ahead and get the drone up in the air around here for a little bit so enjoy the footage guys and I hope this was super helpful I hope this helped at least somebody uh, if you have any problems feel free to comment down below and ask me uh, some questions if you're having any problems at all hi there everyone so if you're still watching I appreciate you enjoying the video now you would consider subscribing if you haven't already because it's free to do and it only helps our channel to grow my dream right now is to make this YouTube journey happen for us so I can do some positive stuff and change the world in a very major positive way. That's my future goal. I really enjoy giving back to the world and I really just want to help as many people as I can in the future. So the faster I'm able to grow and the faster I'm able to make content that people really want to watch and I'm able to spend more time just finding out, going, going around and finding out ways to entertain you guys and have that connection with you all and travel the world and see you guys in person and make memories that is what this is all about I, I want to be able to not have to work I want to be able to buy my mom a house yes but all that good stuff happens in time and what it's really about is the memories for me being able to meet people and enjoy moments that otherwise wouldn't happen without this YouTube channel happening for us so it's been a great journey I've been doing this for about three four years now and again I appreciate you guys watching every single one of you guys all the new subscribers the past week or two has been amazing for the channel because of the DJI Avada it's really helped me to gain subscribers and get viewers and gain retention on YouTube and I couldn't do that without you guys. Honestly, you guys are the reason that I continue to make the videos. I enjoy doing it. I enjoy going out and filming. I enjoy buying new drones. I enjoy just living in the moment and having a good time. But without you guys, I wouldn't have anybody to do it for or share these moments with. I've met some amazing people in the past couple years doing this. And every second, I wouldn't trade for the world because it's opened up so many doorways uh, around Las Vegas just living in Las Vegas and meeting as many people as I have and getting the connection with those people and networking has been super helpful and useful and now people will travel <laughs> and tell people about us and that's what it's all about I mean I, I want our name the Mosh Mob name to gain momentum as a positive movement that's doing something awesome that's giving back to the world first through entertainment obviously through YouTube you have to have a niche and you have to narrow down that niche and get an audience that's what it's all about you have to gain an audience that wants to continuously watch your videos that's what retention is all about so without you guys honestly without you guys I couldn't make videos it wouldn't make no sense because I'd, I'd be getting low views I've been getting higher and higher views because I've been making better content in my own head that's uh, I've been creating better content because you guys are watching longer you guys are <laughs> reaching out to me and wanting to spend more time with me and that is a good feeling all itself to be able to travel around and go out further distances I'm such an introvert and I've been stuck around my area for so long so to be able to go out to like the Colorado River or Red Rocks you guys have opened up the world for me and it, I can never say with words how much that means to me so thank you all again for watching this video I put this at the very end so that it wasn't boring the people who just want to see how to set up the Avada but anybody still watching this is for you this really is and, and I, I appreciate every single one of you so if you need anything from me honestly human to human even just through the screen feel free to reach out to me I'm always here for you I really am I want to do everything that I can to help people and I want to meet great people and do really cool stuff and YouTube can open up that door for us so let's make this dream happen let's hit 1500 subscribers by the end of this year by 2023 that would be pretty cool I think that would be amazing uh, I have bigger dreams obviously not just 1500 subscribers and it's never just about the count it's never just about the viewers and the, the numbers it's, it's not always about that but to make dreams happen to make big things happen you have to make better content get retention all that nonsense stuff in order to make the bigger stuff happen so 
help us to do that help the mosh mob gain traction and it'll come back tenfold you guys will love what the future holds i have some insane ideas for the future so just stick with us i'm not gonna quit and you shouldn't give up on us either so thank you guys really heart to heart i love each and every one of you guys and i'll catch you guys in the next video peace and love